Hey everyone, Val here, and I just got back from Food Lion. Uh, a little disappointed with the store this morning. They didn't have any lettuce. They didn't have any strawberries. It just seemed like there were a lot of things that were out, and it is a Thursday when I'm recording this, so I would have thought... No, actually it's only Wednesday. So I would have thought they would have had the store stock from the weekend. Um, just a, a lot disappointed. I didn't need a whole lot. I'm trying to work through the freezers. I want to get rid of the meat that's been frozen for a while. So I'm going to work through the freezers and uh, try to clear some of that out. So I just needed some of the little things, but I would have liked to have some fresh strawberries and I would have liked to have some lettuce. And I guess I can go to a farmer's market. We don't have any really close to us, but, um, or maybe a Wegmans, but again, that's an hour off from our house. Here's my Food Lion haul. I have bananas, and I like them a little bit green, so I got the green ones. 2% uh, milk for Steve. They had fresh cherries. I was glad to see those, so I did get a bag of those. I like to snack on those. They had some really large cantaloupe. I got one of those. They were actually only $3, so I didn't think that was bad. Got a couple of peaches to replace the strawberries. A thing of blueberries. The cabbage looked good. I got a cabbage. I think I'll do cabbage and turkey kielbasa sometime this week. I have two baking potatoes. 18 eggs. I have four of the Food Lion brand tomato paste and one of the Food Lion brand diced tomatoes with onion and roasted garlic. I might put this in a pot of beans. I have some um, dried beans from our garden and I think I'm going to fix those with some diced tomatoes. Steve needed bread so I got him his Italian bread that he likes and then I also got some thick cut uh, white bread and I was thinking of making French toast for Steve because I haven't done that in a while and I did that up in Alaska for the the team and I just thought I hadn't done that for a while for Steve so I thought I'd make him some French toast. Uh, A1 thick and hearty when you can find it it's good to get it that's what we like in our hamburgers um, and it was actually on sale so I picked up one of those we needed some sweet baby Ray's honey barbecue sauce, the Yasso bars, the mint chocolate chip, and I got a cookies and cream. I got uh, Food Lion brand uh, garlic sticks, garlic bread sticks. I had some uh, frozen ziti that I made and froze a while back. I pulled that out today so that we can use that up. Like I said, I want to try to use up a lot of the stuff out of my freezer. Uh, and there are some things that I made ahead dinners that I need to use up. I did get the Chiboni Zero Sugar. The uh, Cheez-Its Cheddar Jack. They didn't have the buffalo that he likes, but he does like the Cheddar Jack too. I uh, got some Applewood Thick Cut Bacon for the day that we have the French Toast. And then I needed a dish soap, so I got my palm olive. So here is the haul, and that's it. Not really any meats except for the bacon. So, how do you think I did? I have my frozen foods, my groceries, the meat, the bacon was $5.49. That was like the in between kind of pricing. It went higher and it went a little bit lower, but it was all fatty. The lower stuff was all fatty. I did get a few savings here. And then my balance was $75.67. So that was it. $75. Almost $76. I don't see it there. That's uh, pretty sad for $75. Y'all let me know what you think. Thank y'all for watching. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and you want to. And let me know if this pricing is about the same as your store because this is kind of pitiful so that little bit of stuff for $75 pretty sad alright thank you all bye now